I'm called driver innocent. I sat my neighbor examinations in upper prison and I managed to become the best with 28. So I feel very happy being the first in the school and it's like it encourages me to do something better than better than that in another time. So I can invite other people to come and study and become like me. And I also say that I thank teachers who managed to give us what I have got and most like elements and ministry teachers, plus our HM who try to give us a lot in our education. Was this to you? I feel very happy for what I've got and it is very good for me because I did not expect this. Okay. People, they say maybe like we are serving, we are in prison, but for me I feel like I'm enjoying it because I'm getting something from it. And it will be most important for my life as we keep on moving as I'm getting a lot from prison. Yeah, I would like to become maybe a business, a business, big man in business because I managed to perform well with distinction in commerce and entrepreneurship. So I'm still remaining with four years in prison. Uh, I will give maybe what I have for people out there is to advise them to not engage themselves in crimes because sometimes they are not beneficial and they are most dangerous for people who engage themselves in them. I'm going to senior for you. I cannot miss this. In sciences, I hope, I hope to take bug because I managed to get a distinction in Aguro Karita. My name is Val Daniel. Um, um, I got Aguro at 36 and it's only that due to other um, subjects like sciences that has really made me to do in that way, but I expected also best. But I'm also very proud that uh, I managed to come out with that. Uh, <clears throat> first of all, I want to thank God for for what I've got and for His uh, support on me. And actually, I'm very happy that He has been standing with me, and I managed to get what I've got today. Secondly, I want to thank the um, uh, UPS. The, that is. Uh, uh, Uganda Prison Services for the good work they are doing for for our life, for rehabilitating us. Uh, in particular, I want to thank Commissioner General Prison and um, uh, OC Upper Prison Luzira for the open door policy that he has tried uh, really as a parent to really care for us so that we study. Thank him so much. And we also I want also to say that. Um, my fellow inmates who are there in, a, in a Boma and others who are just there doing another business, so that let us persist so much into whatever thing that we are doing, so that we make onto, we really focus on the goal. Because we see others are there, they are on their own businesses and they cannot even determine themselves. Remember one of the authors said that um, um, we are sometimes the ignorance, are, our choices sometimes. That's why we don't make a step ahead. We choose to be ignorant. Otherwise, we would have looked for what we don't know. Future, why I'm struggling here and there with my studies, uh, and my focus is on journalism. That's what I, what I want to be. That's why I struggle also in in other in subjects like history and CRH and the rest of other subjects that can really uh, link me to that uh, uh, that view of mine. More Richard by the name, and I got aggregate 56, and I'm very proud for, for what I've got because that is what I've tried. That uh, as I'm in this place, I will not be the same. Even though I was condemned, that that is the world that has condemned me, but I make it to be a, just something which is abandoned. That is why I concentrated on the studies. This is what I managed to get, and I thank the prison service of giving us this chance and the general commissioner general of opening the school and also to open our eyes because most of us we came where we cannot manage to study 
And because of that ignorance, we ended up falling in this kind of offenses. So that's why we are in this place. So this place, according to what I've got, I think has changed my life and I will never be the same as I came. And at this time now, I'm urging people who are on death row, they should not see that they're on death row and that is the end of life. No, there is another life after this. That's why we need to focus much on studies because the studies will widen our ways and will change our life. This is what we have got and we are very happy of it. And I think at this time, I'm urging my brothers who are still remaining there that they're serving their sentences, but serving the sentence alone will not change us. It's only the school which has been opened because many, as I said, outside there, they cannot manage to pay even the fees. So the, the government has decided to open for us the school so that we can go in the community and live as a, a new people and to know where we can begin, not to go outside there as where we have been without doing any other thing. But this school can open our eyes and uh, we go out and help the community where we have been living. My name is Archibuga Ismaili Sekoyama. I began here from, from P7, that was 2015, 2015. Uh, I managed to make it to, pa to pass in second grade. Uh, from there, and then I joined the upper, upper secondary school, upper prison secondary school, or in secondary school. I've been struggling with my staff. I thank the OC, I thank the staff. I thank the people who prepare for us food, uh, offices, control, RPs who have been favored us because as students we have been favored so much we can move at any time. So I thank the RPs, RP bombers. I thank everybody who has managed to help us to achieve what we have achieved. Uh, I've managed to pass in second grade uh, having 39 aggregates, uh, which I was not expecting in fact. I thank God for that. I thank my teachers, my HM. In fact, he is beyond an HM, but he is a parent amid the stars. Mr. Gilbert, may God bless you. May God bless the Uganda Prison Service for having allowed us to achieve education. I came in prison when I could not even understand English news. I could not understand or re understand music, which is in English. Now I, I am able to listen to good to, to English news, to listen to music and understand what it, it means. I thank a lot Mr. Gilbert for having encouraged our teachers, both inmate teachers and the external teachers. I also thank the nurses, majorly our school nurse, Madam or Sister Abitres Nasaka. She's a careful lady because during the, the time of examinations, she was here very early in the morning and she could leave late. She could ask you who is sick before we went for exams. So I thank our doctors, our sisters, nurses for the work that they are doing amid the stars. Uh, from here, as a person with no aid, with no, with no relatives, I'm expecting to help people who majorly orphans, people who are like uh, this one is in prison to help them. I want to be a teacher. I want to be a teacher to teach those people in Kalamoja, the oppressed, the orphanies, people. I feel bad to see people in camps. I need to help them when I live here. This is in the upper, it is the 60th year, but I have spent 10 years in prison. I remain with 10 years from now. Uh, it is a defilement. But oh, another thing with the defilement, uh, I, what I have gone through, I will never ever, and I discourage people who disturb school going girls. <laughs> what we have gone through reading in trans night, those people should, those girls should be left to read their books. So I will never ever tackle or attempt to disturb school going girls. Of, of course, I'm going to senior five because I have, I, I have already a combination. I must be there come Monday this week. I must be in the class and I'm ready for it. I have already earned my clothes, ready for the class. Uh, by the time I left, I had stopped in primary six. I came here, I was given a chance, I started P7. Now I have in pocket senior four certificate. Uh, my goal is also to get senior six certificate, inshallah. Um, I'm called Dinomia Gilbert, the head teacher of prison in med schools. I feel happy that today we have received UC exam, uh, examination results 2019. I feel happy that we have managed to score nine 
second grades, 14 third grades, then 23 and fourth grade. No one was in division seven and only two failed. Then I had one who was absent and the total of 49 that had registered, but 48 managed to sit the exams. I am very happy that with the performance that we've managed to get compared to 20, uh, 27, 2018, we performed better because in 2018 we had 7 in second grade, we had 20 in third grade, we had 11 in fourth grade, we had one in division 7 and one in division 9 and for that year they registered 43 candidates. But what I'm saying that I'm happy with last year's performance is that with the 2018, the best performer had scored 36 aggregates, but this 2019 results, the best one scored 28 aggregates, only that he was disappointed by English, where he scored a past seven, and of course now they have changed the system. If you don't get a credit in English, you have to jump a grade. So I'm very happy that with his performance, the best one, it was really very good. And given the conditions, uh, that they go through. Surely it was very nice and it is very good performance compared to 2018. Uh, then um, I must say that I'm hoping that with the new curriculum that we are going to start implementing in senior one, it is going to be, we shall be happy with it because when you look at our students, we don't only look at excellence, but we also have some other life skills that we take them through, some training that we take them through so I'm happy that with the new curriculum that is coming where we are looking at competence-based, surely we shall be there and we shall be celebrating because they are not looking at the first grades and uh, those other things, but they'll be looking at the skills that students will have gained. So I'm very happy that for us we are doing that, but when it comes to NEB, when they, are, when they are grading, because we are still using the old curriculum, they look at those ones who have performed well. So I hope in the four years to come, those ones who are going to join Senior 1 when they are go to Senior 4, we shall really celebrate so much because I'm very much aware that we shall be there because we shall be looking at skills and other things related to that.